Most expensive projects in Africa of all time. Hello, this virus. Welcome back to another informative video presented to you by Desplor and thanks for watching. In this video, we shall be counting down the most expensive projects in Africa of all time. A massive Omega project on large scale, complex ventures that typically cost $1 billion or more, take many years to develop and build and involve public and private stakeholders, are transformational and impact millions of lives. Apart from attracting a large amount of public attention, they are also of substantial impact on communities, environment and budgets. Mega projects require care in the project development process to reduce any possible optimism bias and strategic misrepresentation. Examples of mega projects include bridges, tunnels, highways, railways, airports, seaports, power plants, dams, wastewater projects, special economic zones, oil and natural gas extraction projects, public buildings, information technology systems, aerospace projects, and weapons systems. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our daily uploads. We do understand that some of these projects may not fulfill all the criteria for a mega project, but this video identifies a wide variety of examples of major historic and contemporary projects that meet one or both mega project criteria. In this video, we shall exclude Akon City, which is estimated to cost $6 billion, because the project is still in its early days. We shall focus on projects that have already been completed or are currently under construction for several months now. Africa has witnessed some of the most historic projects in the past and present. Among these mega projects, here are the most expensive ones of all time. Note that there could be projects that were and are more expensive than the ones in the video, but their budgets were not publicly declared or uncertain. So with that out of the way, let's get started. Number 10. Grand Ethiopian Dam cost $4.8 billion. The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam, formerly known as the Millennium Dam, is a gravity dam under construction on the Blue Nile River in Benishango Gomuz in Ethiopia. Work on the 6,000 megawatts dam began in 2011 and is now 70% complete way behind the July 2017 completion date. The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam will be the largest hydroelectric power plant in Africa and the seventh largest in the world, that's once it gets completed. It is estimated that the reservoir will take 5 to 15 years to fill with water. The $4.8 billion facility is however facing criticism from right groups who argue that it has displaced nearly 20,000 people. The project is owned by the Ethiopian Electric Power Corporation and is funded by the people and government of Ethiopia. The project will not only serve Ethiopia, but it will also serve Sudan and Egypt. Number 9. The Mambila Hydroelectric Power Project Cost $5.8 billion Nigeria is undertaking construction of a mega hydropower dam as it seeks to boost its energy production. Dubbed Mambila Hydroelectric Power Project, the facility which has been planned for more than three decades is one of the biggest construction projects in Africa. The Mambila Hydroelectric Power Project, which has been undertaken by China's Shino Hydro Corp at the cost of $5.8 billion, will be connected to three dams across the Dongo River in Taraba State, Nigeria. The facility will have a total installed capacity of 3,050 megawatts of electricity. The project is being undertaken by Nigeria's Federal Ministry of Power, Construction and Housing, with the help of Chinese investments. Expected to commence operation in 2030, Mambila will be Nigeria's biggest power plant, producing approximately 4.7 billion kilowatts of electricity in a year. The $5.8 billion is expected to generate up to 50,000 local jobs during the construction process. Number 8. Mother Fontaine Mega City – $8 billion Mother Fontaine New City is a Chinese-funded $8 billion city that is being built in Mother Fontaine, Johannesburg, South Africa, as a hub for Chinese firms investing in Africa. The 1,600-hectare metropolis to be known as Mother Fontaine Mega City is designed by the Shanghai Zendai Group and is the company's first venture estate. Work for the proposed Mother Fontaine Mega City, whose groundbreaking was held in 2015, is expected to be completed in the next 15 to 20 years. The city will include commercial, industrial, and residential components. The plans indicated that the city will include 55,000 housing units. 1,468,000 meter square of office space and all necessary amenities for urban life in the form of a single large-scale urban district. Unfortunately, 
This project has never seen the light of the day due to conflicting visions between the construction company Zendei and the city of Johannesburg, the hosting city of the project. Number 7. Kenya Standard Gauge Railway Cost $9.9 .9 billion Kenya is building a 969km standard gauge railway from Mombasa to Malaba at a cost of $9.9 .9 billion in what is built as one of the largest and most ambitious transport infrastructure projects in Africa. The first phase of the project, which spans 472 kilometers from Mombasa to Nairobi, has been completed at a cost of $3.27 billion, while Phase 2A from Nairobi to Naivasha, which is 120 kilometers, is currently under construction at a cost of $1.5 billion. On the other hand, Phase 2B of the new railway from Naivasha to Kisumu of 270 kilometers is set to cost $3.8 billion while Phase 2C, a 107km extension from Kisumu to Malaba, will consume $1.31 billion. The gauge railway runs parallel to the narrow gauge Uganda railway that was completed in 1901 under British colonial rule. Number 6. Bagamoyo Port – $10 billion Tanzania has embarked on the construction of a billion-dollar mega port at the Swahili historical town of Bagamoyo as it raises to become a regional economic powerhouse. Majorly funded by China, Bagamoyo port is expected to handle 20 million containers a year by 2045, making it the largest such facility in East Africa. The project is a tri-state venture between Tanzania, China and Oman. State-owned China Merchants Port is building the port while an Omani Sovereign Wealth Fund will establish a 1,700 hectare special economic zone adjacent to the port. What commenced in 2018, and if completed, will be the largest deep water port in Africa. Number 5. Lagos Calabar Railway Cost $11.11 billion Nigeria and China have concluded a contract agreement worth $11.11 billion for the construction of the Lagos Calabar Coastal Railway Line in Nigeria. The 1,400km Lagos Calabar Railway is without doubt one of the major infrastructure projects in Africa. The project, which was initially contracted to a Chinese company, is being eyed by the Ameri Metro Inc. based in the US after the Chinese failed to raise the funds. On completion, the Lagos Calabar Railway will connect the cities of Port Harcourt, Uyo, and Aba, thereby enhancing movement of goods and services in the region. However, the first segment of the rail project is expected to be ready within two years and upon completion will link all seaports. The project is also expected to create business hubs meant for commercial activities. Number 4. Dangote Oil Refinery Cost $14 billion Africa's richest man Aliko Dangote is building a huge oil refinery in Ibeju Lekki district on the outskirts of Lagos, Nigeria at an estimated cost between $12 billion and $14 billion. With a capacity to process 650,000 barrels of crude oil a day, Dangote Oil Refinery will be one of the world's biggest oil refineries when it begins operations in 2022. The refinery, which is expected to generate 9,500 direct and 25,000 indirect jobs, will produce Euro-V quality gasoline and diesel, as well as jet fuel and polypropylene. While Dangote took a $3.3 billion syndicated loan which Standard Chartered PLC arranged, about 60% of Dangote oil refinery will be self-funded. The Dangote oil refinery will process a variety of light and medium grades of crude oil to produce Euro-V quality clean fuels including gasoline and diesel, as well as jet fuel and polypropylene. Number 3. Konza Technology City Cost $14.5 billion Kenya has embarked on the construction of a $14.5 billion technology city in Makakos County in a bid to attract technology talents and investors to drive its economic growth. Konza City, which is located 64 kilometers south of the capital Nairobi, is modeled around the U.S. Silicon Valley, hence the Monica African Silicon Savannah. The smart city targets business process outsourcing, software development, data centers, disaster recovery centers, coal centers, light manufacturing industries, and research institutions. Konza has so far attracted several wealthy investors, including a leading Korean university, although the slow pace of the project is raising concerns among its key stakeholders. Number 2. Egypt's new capital city. Cost $45 to $58 billion. 
Construction of housing units in a new yet to be named administrative capital of Egypt has been completed, but delivery will be within a year once key facilities have been installed. Located 55 kilometers east of Cairo, the smart city has 21 residential districts and 25 commercial districts. The city will have a recreational park double the size of New York City's Central Park, 90 km square of solar energy farms, and several artificial lakes. Other key features include a technological park, 40,000 hotel rooms, a theme park four times the size of Disneyland, 2,000 educational institutions, 1,250 mosques, 663 hospitals and clinics, and a new international airport. Transfer of government ministries, foreign embassies, parliament, and presidential palaces is expected to take place between 2020 and 2022 at a cost of $45 billion. The total cost of the venture is yet to be disclosed, but the city is indeed one of the biggest mega projects in Africa. Number 1. Grand Inga Dam cost $100 billion. The Grand Inga Dam a proposed hydroelectric dam at the Inga Falls on Congo River in the Democratic Republic of Congo tops the list of the top 10 biggest construction projects in Africa of all time. The dam is designed to have an average output of 39,000 megawatts annually, nearly twice as much as the Three Gorges Dam in China, making it the world's largest hydropower scheme. Grand Inga Dam is expected to cost an estimated $100 billion, including the cost of transmission lines needed to carry its power across the continent. The project was expected to begin by December 2016. However, in July of that year, the World Bank withdrew its funding following disagreements over the project. There you have it, the explorers. Those are the most expensive projects in Africa of all time. Thanks for watching this video. If you want us to cover any of your top 10 topics, leave a suggestion in the comments and we will do well to grant your request. Also, if you did enjoy the video, do well to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends.